practically tells you that there is nothing unique about the president's speech. What he said is what he has said all the while. So after telling us that he is aware of our suffering, like he has always said, I didn't see anything that denotes practical intentions to tackle those causes of our hardship. Because everything still boils down to uh, making us believe that they, they have solved problems that are persisting. After that, he talked about insecurity, for instance. He made us to believe that they have uh, uh, watered down the level of insecurity in Nigeria. When it's very clear to us that to travel from one point to another in the country is just something you do with your faith in God. But when we talk about security, we know the situation. We know what it is, it's, it's, all, it's all about. So telling us that they've tackled the insecurity situation or giving us the impression that they've gone fine doing that. For me, it's better you make people understand, yes, this problem uh, is there. We are making efforts and we'll get to a point where the result will be pronounced. But he made us to believe that we're already seeing the evidence of it. If I let me tell you one statement he made that really weakened my, my, my hope in his government. When he said that there, we are already seeing light at the end of the tunnel. If you must consider the economic situation in the country today, as far as Nigerians are concerned, we can only see darkness.